Yep, that's it. There's like two by the edge. Another example of not giving up. really intimidating cleaning the carb of a expensive motor but got it done shorten this fuel line so it's uh, ready to roll now there was something clogged in the idle jet of the carburetor of the 9.8 but it's all done it's all ready it's a flood tide it's like six and a half feet tonight we're gonna try to go out uh, to a spot we don't normally go to um, we usually go on the Wander River but we're gonna try something new and we're gonna try to see some tailing fish. Hopefully we'll get something on camera and hopefully tag something. I'm gonna be throwing some of my flies that I tied. And yeah, forgot to mention I made these shirts. As you've seen, I posted, this one's covered in cat hair, but strip, set, and forget. Little uh, fishing and surfing Charleston shirts. I appreciate the support, I've already sold a bunch. Here's that little YouTube logo the Marsh Convict logo that I made in uh, Illustrator, and yeah. If you want one, get in touch with me somehow, Instagram, whatever. I don't have anything set up on the website, but I really appreciate it. Now let's go fish. In my hand, it's game you're over. You're done. Game over. Nothing I do from that point is okay. And we've seen probably seven tails so far, all of which are a little too, too fast moving to catch. So now we're fishing the outgoing. Katie's taking selfies. She's really focused on the selfies tonight. We just had a fight about it. They want to fight, really. We're very honest with each other. Apparently, I'm a psycho. Fishing psycho. So there's that. <laughs> oh, it's pretty beautiful out here, regardless. It's like a. S I want to say. West offshore. I did the rolling, but yeah. We're gonna cover some more water. Hopefully, find some other tailing fish. It's slowly draining out. I see some uh, sediment in the water. Going pretty quick. Look at this, this is just unreal. The only time to launch. Oh, it's deep enough. 
Yeah. It's not going to be low when we come back. Ooh, what was that? No, that's a lot of bait. It's not going to be low when we come back. No, it's still pretty high. It'll at least be enough water for us to get back. Really? Are you fucking kidding me? Yep, that's it. Yep. Yep. We got one on. Just ate the shrimp. He is running. Can you come over here a little bit? Oh, he's still running. Yep. We need to go get him. Let me get on the boat so he tows us. Rover it up into these reeds. And now he is still going. Please. Oh, he's still going. See him still running? All right, slow down a little bit. But keep us going a little bit. I just want, don't want to like run him over and then freak out. <sighs> First rat on the boat. If I don't lose him in the grass, he's in some thick grass now. Good job, babe. All right, you're good. We're gonna run him over. Yeah. Yep. 
He's not happy. Oh, it's a good fish. Look at that sunset. He's almost done. You saw there was two right there? Yeah. There was like two by the edge. Oh, this is where he goes under the boat. Come on, buddy. We were just talking, Katie and I, about how uh, sometimes <laughs> this always happens to us, like last light. We'll get a fish. Ooh. I thought he was small too. Like his tail was so small. It's a good one. Oh my God, that's a brute. Oh my, god, oh my god, he's huge. Holy shit. Right in the corner. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That last bit of energy, and he's on the 20 pound fluoro leader. He's not small. Still pretty shallow, but definitely deeper reeds right here. He towed us a while. Damn, he's not wanting to give up. <laughs> he's like digging down. All right, I'm gonna land him. Not a small fish. All right, y'all. Should be a clear example of not giving up. Because you can get a pick of that sunset. Wow, here since like 6.15. It's eight now, and we've been grinding, trying to get one of these. We finally got it, but. Fell for the shrimp pattern. Him and a friend were over in those shallow reeds by the island, and um, yeah. But thank you, babe, for putting up with me. We got in a little tussle because we literally were basically paddling on top of redfish. And then, uh, you know, I freaked out because the fish was like here, six feet away. And yeah, then uh, we saw these two crawling. Well, we saw one of these two crawling very shallow. And that was the first fish to slime the rover. So yeah, that was sick. But we're probably gonna try to pull out of here and uh, see if there's any fish, but hell yeah, that's my first red in a while. And after Destin kind of missing three reds in the surf, it feels really good. Cause I honestly thought that fish was a lot smaller. Did you see the tail? Uh, no, but I, I never see the tail. She never sees the tails, so she's like, selfie in and drink in and white claws you know no loss but anyway let me compose myself and we're gonna keep looking might get one more because this is like prime time if you guys ever give up before the sun goes completely down you are missing quality redfish time so yeah stay tuned look at that crazy crazy 
Is this not crazy? Quick outro today. Um, thanks for watching. Like, throw a comment if you have any questions about the rover. Check out the other videos about my rover if you have any interest in that. Otherwise, see you out there. Keep them tight. Later, guys. Crazy.